guys, this is Who Won't, and this is a video tutorial on how to use generator settings in your server.properties or customize your super flat world in single player. Uh, now, I couldn't find any anything for this on the internet anywhere. I searched pretty hard, and I pretty much had to figure most of it out on myself. And um, let me go ahead and show you. Uh, now, when you go to customize and I'll show you how this works with server.properties in just a second. Um, they have some presets here. You could select a preset and um, you look at this and you're like what, what does all this crap mean? And what it means is this two, the first two, I have no clue what it means. <laughs> all I know is that it seems to have to be in there and I tried to figure out what it was. I tried to use different numbers. I couldn't figure it out. If somebody knows please let me know because I'm really curious. Um, that's a semicolon, um, not a colon. Uh, and what happens is, I'm not sure what the two is, and then there's a semicolon, and the seven, or these numbers from here, all the way to the next semicolon is your layers that you want to customize. And it starts from the bottom up. So this first one right here is the is seven for um for river. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What am I talking? Seven is for, I think, oh, okay, I'm sorry. Seven is for um, bedrock. <laughs> I don't know where I got that from. Um, and you only need one, or you only want one layer of bedrock, so the seven is means it's just one layer of bedrock. Then you have to put commas in between them. So it's seven comma. That means you go to the next block that you want. And the next one is the, when the first number before the X is how many layers you want of the next block. So it's two of number three and, and I'll, I'll send a link to uh, where you can look up the data values for the blocks I'll put that in my description but if you go to the Minecraft wiki it's on there uh, three is uh, stone or wait uh, I'm sorry dirt I think um, and you want two layers of sorry about that that was my phone and you want two layers of uh, dirt and then one layer of dirt with grass on top of it and uh, that's what the two is for three is dirt two is for dirt with grass on top of it and then there's another semicolon and then the next number right here is for what you want to use for what um, biome you want um, and then there's another semicolon and I'll, and I'll put the list in, of that also for that also in the um, in the description and um, then, like I said, there's another semicolon, and then the next area is for options that you'd like to add um, to the flat world. You can put um, stronghold for strongholds, and I'll put the list of that also for that also. Uh, village to spawn villages, dungeon to spawn dungeons, mine shafts, etc. Uh, you could put lava lakes, um, just lakes. Um, I don't think they're separated. Let me see. Yeah, they're separated with a comma. Uh, biome. I don't. I think I figured out what it is. I think it just means large biomes. Um, I think you're, it means you're gonna have one large biome of, of this one that you select. I think. I'm not really sure if somebody knows, or if I'm wrong. Please let me know. So let me show you something cool. You ready for this? Okay. Actually, let's. Let me. Yeah. Look, okay. Clear this out. Two semicolon. Say you wanted bedrock, dirt, grass, sponge, and uh, you want a plains um, biome, and then you want lava lakes on top of it. You'd put, let's see, you have to put the two, and then it'll be seven for bedrock, two layers of, oh, yeah, of two layers of dirt, and then sponge is 19, I think, one layer of 19, one is the biome, and I'll put lava lake, it's like that, and as you can see, it shows bedrock, dirt, sponge, etc. And we'll create the world. Take it 
takes just a second. And look at that. Where's my lava lakes? There should there's supposed to be lava lakes on top of it. Oh. I thought no, I didn't see anything. Let me look at it real quick. Where's my lava lakes? Okay, let me put it in one more time. Actually, let's just do a different one. Let's say we wanted, um, <laughs> say you wanted like fire for the top level. You do two semi, oops, two semicolon seven comma Oh, I don't, well, I don't know what the number for fire is. Okay, how about... Okay, here's a cool one. Sorry. So it's going to be bedrock, dirt, stone, lava, air, and then grass. Check this out. Alright, so you're like, oh, okay, just regular world? No, it's not. It has lava under it and air in between. Awesome. And that's pretty much how you do it. Now, um, if you would like to incorporate that into your into your server, all you do is copy this code right here that you have. Um, the way I do it is you go to the end of it, hold shift and press your backwards arrow to highlight it, and then control C will copy it, and then just paste it into your generator dash settings. And that pretty much covers it. I'll put all the information in there, but you could pretty, you could use any of the codes in the data values. Uh, and if I'm not mistaken, yeah, use uh, decimal, not hex. Um, you can put fire on top, and it'll like literally put fire on the, across the whole top of the map, uh, anything like that. So that's pretty much how you do it. This is Who Won't. Thanks for viewing. Please like and subscribe.